finally moved to America. We got married, we had our wedding, we had our honeymoon. No. I can afford it, but I'm not spending that money. You guys, America's too expensive. I don't even wanna, I don't wanna get into how much New York was. I don't wanna. Yeah. That's a whole different video, you guys. When we talk about New York, y'all, y'all are gonna be like, bruh. We went all over the places. We went left, right, up, down, ABC, and we're still traveling. Hey guys, how's it going today? It's your boy, Brandon. <laughs> is that you're gonna display my hair? Yeah. <laughs> What's your name again, beautiful? Sora. Wow. And we are in America. America. Oh my gosh, you guys, we finally <laughs> we, we finally moved to America. We got married. We had our wedding. We had our honeymoon. I'm just BSing you guys. We need to go to that. <laughs> <laughs> we bought a house in America. That's why we decided to move to America. Correct. We uh, decided to skip the wedding, skip all that, and just purchase a house. We used all that money. Because, you know, weddings are so expensive. We decided, why waste money on a wedding? Who needs a wedding? Do you need a wedding? You don't need a no. wedding. You need a house. A house mm -hmm. is more important. Yeah. So we moved to America. And right now, we're living in my mother's basement. What? <laughs> How do you love this basement? I love it. It's bigger than our house. <laughs> All jokes aside, we are in America right now on vacation. It's Sora's first time in America. Yeah. What? And it's my first time back in America after six years. So you guys might be wondering why we're in America. Originally, I came to America earlier this year. I went to mm -hmm. CES, which is in Las Vegas. I got flown out to Las Vegas by LG mm -hmm. to do presentations for them. One of the main speakers for LG's booth, so I gave a couple presentations mm -hmm. about a bunch of cool products and I was also a model for my product. So when the product launched, I'm all over the world as the model and I'm also in Las Vegas giving a presentation about myself mm -hmm. and my own commercials. So that's the reason why I came to the States originally. We were planning to come to visit America. We didn't know when. Mm -hmm. To come to visit America, I need the visa. Everything was like very slow. I had to go to Mongolia and then I had to to start working again because of the delays and stuff. Originally, we were gonna go to Vietnam mm -hmm. on a vacation together. So we were planning the whole vacation. Out. Yeah, we're gonna go vacation. And I'm all excited to go on vacation with you. Yeah. And then I got the proposal of getting the job of working with LG. So I didn't know if I was not gonna go to Vietnam and then like, right before we were gonna buy the Vietnam ticket. I got the confirmation. It was like couple friends trip. His schedule was like too tight. So he decided to not go to Vietnam. So she got to go on vacation to the hot beach or whatever. It wasn't hot. It was winter in Vietnam. They have, Viet which they have is, winter? Yeah, they How have they winter. Have, How they have winter? They have four seasons. Since when? When they have four seasons? What? Depending on the part. It's like, Vietnam is like really long island. Yes, yeah, south is warmer, but the north is colder. Mm. We we went to Tanang. We were debating to go to Thailand or Vietnam. We checked on the flight tickets and the prices went up so high. Before Corona, we went to Vietnam. It was cheap. Like, now the flight is like two times expensive. So we ended up going to Vietnam yeah. because it was cheaper than Thailand and whatever else. Like you were saying for plane tickets, the plane ticket that I had to go to America, Las Vegas, it was so expensive. And it mm. was just like, why? Because the borders are now opening and yeah. restrictions are becoming less. I paid for her ticket to come here. My ticket to America was three times more than her ticket. It was my birthday gift. Bruh. You guys, this is all I'm gonna say to you guys. Don't date. You know what? Be abstinent. Don't date. Be celibate. Be abstinent. Whatever it's called. Don't just don't even stay in a relationship. Because when you're in a relationship, it just goes. What do you think about America so far? I really like it. America is really huge country, really different than Asia because I only visited Asia. The biggest problem we had with her coming, oh, Brandon, you need to plan out stuff that we're gonna do, plan out stuff. And y'all know I'm not a big planner. Y'all saw my proposal. Y'all know I don't plan. Bruh. I try to plan, but it don't go as planned. But she was like, oh, let's go to this state. Let's go to this state. And I'm like, babe, I've never been to this state. And she's all like, you're American. This is your hometown. I'm like, yeah, this is your country, but how don't you know? We had to learn the 50 states in like mm. third grade. I don't remember them. <laughs> we had to learn all the capitals. I remember them. Mm. But she'd be like, oh, how you not know this area? I'm like, babe, last time I came here, I was four. <laughs> But this is your hometown. Google. <laughs> I was like, you know everything in Mongolia? Every If I tell you this, that street in Mongolia, you know it? No. 
it's the same year. So my first thought of America, first feeling felt like I'm in a movie or something like that. Everything I watched is here. The big truck and stuff. It's it's just like the horror movie I watched when I was younger. It felt very different, but like familiar. Familiar. It's, yeah. it's like the movies you've seen. Yeah. I was gonna say, uh, it felt like a movie because you know we living in this <laughs> mom's basement and it's so big. It's like it's like a castle and uh, my mom got a Lamborghini, so I'd be driving her in the Lambo and I'd be picking her up like. <laughs> And, and the, the door wings open up and I'd be like, mm. get in, like, like, let's go for a drive, like Fast and the Furious, you know? Yeah. Because every American lives in a big old house with 12 rooms and has a Lamborghini and a Mercedes-Benz, BMW, I don't know, what, what's the American dream again? A white picket fence? Nope. I don't know, Some, something. It was just very different. Mm. Then we went to the mall, we went to outlet, we went to the grocery store. I was in shock. It was really cheap. It's cheaper than Korea. The fruit, vegetable, groceries, it's really cheap. We have some videos that we're gonna show at the grocery store. Mm. The entire time, this is sore. <gasps> oh my god! They have hundred types of apples, and it's so cheap. It's so great country. First thoughts of America is like. I want to move here. The air was fresh, the weather is great, everything was cheap except the restaurant. I'm, I'm still laughing, you're just like, oh my gosh, 72 different types of bread. <laughs> it's only one dollar. Why is this bread six? But this is a dollar. Oh yeah, and also peanut butter was like whole wall. And ice cream is like, a house. It's like 20 rows of ice cream. It's just a grocery store. A small one. If you go to Walmart or like Target, it's bigger. That was like culture shock. Wow. And the alcohol wasn't so cheap. Buying alcohol, very cheap. The restaurant is really expensive. Like I hate paying taxes and tea because I lived in Korea a long time. So I really like custom. So we pay taxes, but it's in built in the price. We don't pay tip. In America, the price is separated and plus taxes and plus tip. The taxes depending on the state, it's different. Different percentage. The tip is starting from 18, 20, 22 here. New York is starting from 20, 22, 25. It's so expensive. If we just increased minimum wage, no, I think our federal minimum wage is still low. Like in Maryland, we just increased it to like $13 or something. I don't know, we, we increased the minimum wage. There's a federal minimum wage and then there's a state minimum wage. Mm -hmm. But like, I think like federal minimum wage, this price, right? And then mm -hmm. Maryland is here, New York is that. But mm -hmm. they haven't increased the minimum wage for tip services for like 30, 40 years, something like that. Mm -hmm. So they make $3 an hour, $3.75 an hour. Mm -hmm. And they make all their money through tip. But then it's just like, okay, you can make a lot of money through tips mm -hmm. if you're at like a upscale restaurant or something or like yeah, a high end yeah. place. Even at like a lower end place, you can still make a good amount of money. But I don't know, it's, it's just different. Like in England, they don't tip. In Korea, they don't tip. Japan, they don't tip. A lot of countries, they don't tip because they just pay their workers a living salary. I wish America would do that. Pay the workers a living salary. And if you want to yeah. tip, you are allowed to tip. I just yeah. wish they paid a higher salary, a livable salary. Like yeah. your employer should be paying you your salary, not the customer. Mm -hmm. I'm paying your employer for the meal. I'm paying two, two times. Two times, yeah. So we think it's cheap, but it's not cheap. So would you move to America? Yeah. Nope. But it's really like inconvenient because the transportation. Uh, it's big countries. You have to have a car. Right. You need the car to live in America. I can't drive a car and we don't have a car. So we, every time we go somewhere else, we have to ask his mom to drive us or we have to borrow his mom's car. Borrow the Lambo. You know, yeah. You <laughs> <laughs> so that's the thing. But I would want to move to America, not at the moment. Not for now, maybe like a few years later, because Korea is really convenient country that has everything nearby. Even the convenience store is next door. Mm -hmm. So in America, everything is like far away. We went to Washington DC. Yeah, we took a subway. There was no public restroom. I was like, I need to pee. The DC bathroom was better than the New York subway bathroom. Oh yeah. New York. New York is a weird place, man. New York is like similar to Hong Kong. Hong Kong is very clean, but New York is dirty, crowded, unsafe. You saw a lady eat poop. What? Train itself was clean. Outside when you're waiting for the train, someone yeah, like yeah, pissed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Homeless people everywhere. That's everywhere. <sighs> Governments be messing up. Yeah. It's just really different. 
New York was different experience, and Washington DC was a different experience. Frederick was different experience, and every place we go, it was different. And I'm really excited for Florida and Georgia. Yeah, I am really excited. I wanted to go to San Francisco, but we checked the flight tickets. It was like, we ain't got California it's, money. It's domestic flight, but it's more than $500. Oh my gosh, that's... <gasps> Welcome to America. For two people, and we're gonna stay there and spend money. I'm not going there this time. I can afford it, but I'm not spending that money. You guys, America's too expensive. I don't even wanna... I don't wanna get into how much New York was. I don't wanna... Yeah. That's a whole different video, you guys. When we talk about New York, y'all, y'all gonna be like, bruh. How much or how long? Never. I hate traveling, you guys. I'm gonna become so famous that they pay me to go on these travel trips. I wanna become a travel YouTuber because I can't afford these plane, this house, and this food. Like, subscribe, comment, so I can go on a trip. We got some interesting vlogs coming for you guys soon. Mm -hmm. Like we said in this video, we went all over the places. We went left, right, up, down, ABC, and we're still traveling. We have a bunch of interesting content coming out that involves our day in America. Yeah. Anyways, you guys, if you guys like these type of videos, make sure you guys like subscribe and leave in the comments below what kind of videos you guys want us to make next mm -hmm. like we said we're gonna be in america for a little bit while longer yeah. so if you want us to go to disney world we might be able to go to disney world what? if y'all want us to go bungee jumping she can go bungee jumping because y'all know i don't like heights Bruh. no i don't want to do it again that was only one time experience mm -hmm. comment below where should we go in washington dc and then florida georgia, georgia. anyways you guys thanks for watching this video mm -hmm. and bye, bye. <sighs> i need to become like a stockbroker or something so i can afford all these trips we're taking mm. bitcoin fighting. <laughs>